What is up YouTube, it's your boy Mousetrap and we back in the building and I'm just here to let you guys know that the giveaway for the two Sundown subs, Terra Amps is active and is ready to be won by one of you guys. You can simply be purchasing, purchasing um, this decal. Um, there's a shirt with this same exact logo on the decal that can get you entries to go ahead and um, win these subs. You can purchase these items and get details on the giveaway by simply going on to my Instagram which is mousextrap or, or um, the official YouTube Instagram which is mousetrap underscore gang. Go on those uh, Instagrams and shoot us a DM and we'll give you all the details and if you want to get your entries in we'll go ahead and process all your orders. Get your um, uh, purchases that you've got to enter sent out to you guys um, immediately. So get your entries in. The giveaway ends May 2nd and I will be announcing the winner on Cinco de Mayo. All the information for the giveaway you can find it in the description of each video from here till the giveaway ends um, the information to purchase where to send money to who to contact everything is in the description of each video um, that's gonna be uploaded from here till the giveaway ends man get those entries in when you guys gonna be um, running around with these speakers inside your vehicles and it could be you by just simply purchasing a sticker or a t-shirt man um, now let's get back to the video and you know get your entries in man YouTube was good. Welcome back to another video. And man, um, hold on. YouTube was good. Welcome back to another video, man. It's your boy Mouse. Man, big shout out to Cali. You know, um, the giveaway is active for the 212s and the amp. You know, it, it's active. And big shout out to Cali, man. You know, Cali so far is, is shining. I think there's like seven people that have entered, and I think four or five, the man, they're from Cali. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to Cali. Man, you guys are doing your thing. But shout out to all the other states that support the channel, man. You guys are awesome. And I think tomorrow, Friday, the giveaway winner for the Double Den should be getting his radio in Cali as well. You see what I'm saying? So shout out to Cali again. Man, you guys are doing your thing, watching the videos, dropping the likes. 956, man, Texas, the Valley. Um, I think I did see somebody from Brooklyn. Um, there's someone from like Daytona, you know, all over, you know, Tampa. Florida man all the surrounding areas here in Florida man shout out to you guys man that watch the videos and you know thanks for supporting it you know um, subscribe man like and share so for today man the, the build for the Silverado it begins man so it begins and the way it, it begun yesterday man when I picked up these door panels so I can start working on I my have a homeboy and he hit me up that his other homeboy um, crashed the Silverado and he actually had like these little small door panels that he had built in his truck um, that had carpet and like a few speakers in it, but they crashed the truck and he was able to get the door panels out of it um, So it had like a whole door panel. I'll be showing you right now um, But what's really cool about that is I can build some door panels and not have to touch the door panels in my Silverado. You see what I'm saying? Um, we can work off of those So many different ways that we can work with that right there You know, I can go ahead and either make a mold of the door one and then cut up my doors or number two cut the panel that's on there right now and then you know rebuild the door and um, break the door down and you know rewrap it um, do new uh, plastic pieces on it if I need to replace any and fiberglass paint you already know that we're gonna do um, painted panels on it man because you know that, that's how we get down out here man but um, I'm thinking about probably doing some Akatera which is the material that they put in like the supercars like the lambs, um, Porsches, you know, all that stuff, man. They use Akatera. They, you don't, they don't use suede. Um, and the Akatera, it lasts longer. It has, like, a, a little bit more richer look to it. So we will be doing Akatera in it. From now on, and all the vehicles are getting Akatera. You know what I'm saying? No more suede. You know, Akatera is the new stuff. And, you know, we're going to get with the, with that va wave. So Akatera, maybe some carbon fiber, and, you know, of course, fiberglass painted, man. So let me go ahead and show you these panels real quick. Uh, so you guys can get a little bit better understanding um, of what's going on. So these are the Sundown SA10 V2 D4s. And imagine, you know, two of these guys right here. When we get to 5,000 subscribers, one of y'all can walk home with it, man. So subscribe to the channel. Let's get to the 5K. All right, for those of you that don't know and first time viewers of the channel, so we got the, the Z71 Silverado. 
and then we got my Trailblazer Super Sport over there across the street. And this is the one that we're going to actually go ahead and do the, the new system on right here, guys. So um, we're going to do a blow through. I still haven't decided what subs we're going to do, but we're going to do some that we can put some serious power onto it. But this is the one. I'm going to go ahead and drop it probably like next week or something like that. Just to start getting a little view of it. But the Z71 is going to get a system. Um, yeah, man. So let me show you these door panels that my boy got. Okay, so this is one of the front door panels that my homeboy hooked me up with. And as you can see, I think that's like a 10 inch. It had a 10, a 10, an 8, and a tweeter. And it got fiberglass, I think. Let me look real quick. Yeah, it got fiberglass, but... Oh, okay, look, it has a cover. Let me see if we can just rip this off real quick, guys. Look, you see? Even if I would do a carpet door panel for a car, man, I'd still have to charge it like two or three hundred bucks. But listen, when it does this, when you're able to do this right here, look, and it even has a staple right there exposed. I don't know if you can see it. Right there. That's not cool. Look. Oh, oh look, it has a staple on it. They did the old wrap around and then glue. Look, you see it? Yeah, this is not cool at all. Whoever did, did these door panels failed miserably. Look at that. The glue sucks for number one. Look, you see? Let me go ahead and, and rip this uh, off real quick and I'll get the camera back. Okay, as you can see, these doors were fiberglass, but the execution on it was not, you know, there. They had an idea, somewhat the right steps, but, you know, obviously it didn't go according to plan. So these right here are like, this is why I always, you know, this is why I charge what I charge for fiberglass door panels. Um, because some people can go ahead and charge you for something like this and listen it is nowhere near where you know what I do look look at that right there and look at that right there and look at that right there the whole cutouts look you see that hump right there look at that and they use cheap glue and look there's not even no sanding and they went ahead and and used the glue um, even if you're just gonna wrap in carpet, it's always good to get it the shine off. I don't know if you guys can look right there, shiny. Always get that shine off because then it opens up the the texture so the, the glue can grab pretty good and you know it can contact good with the glue from the panel to the carpet. And they didn't sand it, you know, and they used like some other wood. They cut it out by hand when you can purchase rings that are already perfect, ready to rock and roll. All you gotta do is hit the router on them and staple. And you know they obviously use some like um, the harder staples to use, and they just went on top of the panel and they didn't really break the door down apart to make sure it doesn't ruin any part of the door. Look, you see like that part's already ruined, so I'm gonna have to figure something out. But we got the door panel, and that's the most important part of it because this door panel alone will cost like probably like two or three hundred bucks. So shout out to my boy for at least getting me the uh, the door panel. So what I'm actually gonna do is I'm actually gonna like maybe cut this out, cut all this section out, and um, so I can just have like the lip that goes around it, and then probably put like a, a piece of wood as a base and build off of that. Um, and then I'm gonna break down like take this piece off, and then take this piece off. And then if I have to take the one off of my truck, then I'll go ahead and, and do it so it, it has like a nicer look. But you know, all this right here, I'm gonna break it down and take it off because it obviously it has that, so I need to get that fixed. Um, and I can order like a new one of these so it looks perfect. And so at the end of the day, you know, the door comes out like beautiful. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna get, so, so my plan for the door panel is maybe do all this right here, going right here, all that painted this Akatera, like the Swain looking material, but yes, yeah, the one that they use in the, the, the supercars, like the Lambos and all that stuff, Akatera. And then I'll take somewhere to get this wrapped and um, maybe the Akatera as well, or a nice vinyl to match on the seats whenever I do the seats. Uh, peanut butter, you know, because I am going to keep the truck um, white, but I feel if I do black, um, a nice peanut butter Akatera, and a nice um, vinyl to match with the Akatera, like peanut butter color. Man, that thing will look nice because the panel that goes right here for the switches, it goes along here and it's carbon fiber. So 
with all those color combos, man, that thing's gonna be deadly, man. That thing's gonna be no joke. You know, I'm gonna try to build the hardest door panels in the truck game. You see what I'm saying? So we when we go to other states and they look at man, they just, we just give that wow factor. Um, if I were to rate these door panels, man, I gotta give this at least a solid like two or three. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just give them that because they knew what they were doing, but they just it just got it done. They didn't really be like, okay, I gotta build me some badass door panels. There's no curves. It's just SpongeBob and flat. So um, we'll give it three, you know, for the effort. All right, so let me show you what the inside of the my door panel looks like. So you see how this is got the carbon fiber right here, and then the rest of it's like black and everything. My door panel actually looks a lot nicer from the door panel. Uh, man, the glare is just really bad. That sun's out there, man. You know, God shining on us, man. He wants to see us succeed. Um, all right, so I think what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna do like a ten, a ten, maybe like an 8 and a 6 and do something really cool behind there with some mesh with the tweeters or some plexiglass I would like to put my uh, my YouTube sign I would like to include like my YouTube logo somewhere right here with some plexiglass or maybe somewhere right here so I may even do like a 10 an 8 and a 6 plexiglass and then like tweeters or something so much can happen you know saying once I start building into it and um, I just got to like picture it, design it a little bit, and then, you know, I'll go with it. But we're going to make these doors like really, really the truth. You see what I'm saying? I'm going to keep a lot of the black interior. Um, we still got so much to do in here, but I think starting off with the door panels is the way to go. I got all four door panels, but the mine, I think it's what we call the crew cab because it's got the shorter doors. And the one that he has was the the actual cab which is the same um the bigger doors and i have the bigger doors um door panels but my truck is the smaller doors so for right now we're just going to use the uh, front doors and we're going to build those and then i'll make my decision whether if i want to build back doors or you know mess my doors up but for right now i don't think we're going to do that we can work around it and still get it loud but yeah i do want to build these front door panels i always have to have the front doors built you know, in case we're riding somewhere and I got to throw the door out on somebody and let them know what time it is. So our outcome of some door panels are going to probably look like something like this. Well, not exactly like this, but just it gives you an idea of the type of door panels that I can build. And like I said, I never actually got to really finish these door panels, but I will. But, you know, this piece was going to go right here with a piece of plexiglass and some light. But, you know, obviously, you know, we can do some nice curves and nice body work. And, um, you know, you see it. And then here's some end results of fiberglass painted doors. And these are like dirty right now. They're not even waxed up. But look at it. Like you cannot see no like dips. Nothing crazy. It's just really dirty. I really took my time, you know, doing door panels. Those door panels over there, man, that's like a hundred dollar door panel, honestly. This is this one right here is probably at least, at least like a twelve, thirteen hundred dollar door panel with paint. And that door, this door panel right here with vinyl, you're probably looking at at least like $800 with the material and everything. That's without speakers. That's just the, the door panel what I would charge. But you see the difference. So when I say we're going to do fiberglass painted door panels, this is what I mean. And of course, we're going to have to do JBL speaker tweeters. And look at that. You know what I'm saying? Like nothing but it's wet. You know what I'm saying? So this is going to be the outcome. And like I said, we're going to do paint, which is this right here, what I'm talking about with the Akatera carbon fiber and you know a little bit of vinyl so you see the outcome of what I can do you know what I'm saying so we're gonna bring those other door panels back to life and the vinyl I could do something like this vinyl you see the texture on it but we'll do something like brown like peanut butter color so it'll match good with that I can tear, man because I want to do peanut butter color seats on my truck look all the door panels are right here the rear doors are right there and then the other um, front door panels right there and like I said, my homeboy called me yesterday. He was like, hey man, you want these door panels? I need to clean up my garage. Um, come pick them up. And man, I was on my way. So shout out to my homeboy, man. If you're watching this video, to Jesse, man, I appreciate you. And guys, don't forget to get your entries in for the giveaway, man. Someone needs to take that system home, put it inside their car, and jam it out. You feel me? Those two 12s and that amp, man, you're, you're going to be loud. Wherever you're at, you're going to be loud. And if 
the person that wins those subs, let me know what you're gonna put that in. Whether you're gonna try to build a box or buy a prefab box or whatever. If you're gonna try to build a box, I hope you try to build a box, man. I, you know, I encourage you to go ahead and try it. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go ahead and give you the specs on the box design. If you tell me what kind of car it is, I'll try my best to somewhat find a car out here and get the measurements so then I can give you actual cut lists and everything. So you can go to Home Depot, get the wood, and if you gotta use screws, wood glue and everything, man, do so. Build that box, man, and you know, I wanna see how it comes out. And if I can, I'll help you out as much as I can. I'll even FaceTime you to, you know, give you a hand while you're there, man. So get your entries in, remember. All right, so look, buying one of these stickers right here We'll get you two entries in, and this sticker costs 10 bucks. It'll get you two entries in for that giveaway. When you buy the shirt with this logo on it, it gets you five entries, and that shirt is 25 bucks. But now, when you go ahead and buy the shirt and the sticker at the same time, which is $30, that'll get you ter uh, 10 entries inside there. And I feel like that's the better buy, so go ahead and get that $30 entry. The all the information and where to send the payment to is in the description of this video and it's going to be in all the descriptions of all the videos and um man good luck to those who get entered like i said man cali's shining right now man they got all the entries in so far but i know man everybody's gonna get some entries someone's gotta win that man you feel me um very good giveaway so yeah there you have it man the silverado's coming in hot man i really do want to see the system of the silverado done i am trying to get the truck done by october time and there's a truck show in texas called otm and i would actually like to go to otm with the system and the truck man and maybe network with some people out there man maybe do a couple sound offs so i want to get this truck done and you know we're all going to build it together and so stay tuned for the videos because i know i'll be having a lot of people in the comments asking how i did this on the fiberglass panels and how i did that so this is a perfect opportunity and we are going to build these door panels together i will be explaining step by step on what to do what products to use and everything man. so subscribe to the channel we're going to build these door panels we're going to build this silverado together and we're going to be jamming all right all right so thanks for watching this video don't forget to get your entries in for the sundowns and the tear amps giveaway don't forget, hit that subscribe button. Let's get to 5K so I can give away some SA Sundown subs too, man. So thanks a lot for watching the video again. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Peace.